Hey, uh, healthy lifestyles. Okay, we here in my kitchen. Um, I'm about to make a smoothie. I know I'm kind of late. Um, I've been making them, but I've just been kind of putting them all around them. So today, I'll make this video, and I'm going to measure this stuff out. I got some juicy juice, apple juice. Um, one serving, 8 ounces, is 110 calories. I know that seemed like a lot, but... I got an alternative if you don't want to, um, you don't want if you want to cut some even more of your calories. We were talking about this in class. It's VH Splash, but it's the diet. Um, it's only got 10 calories per serving. Terry, I know you said you like sweeter stuff, so you probably might want to go with the full juice. Um, I got one banana in there. I'm gonna put that in the blender. I take, I buy, I buy all my fruit, I buy all my fruit, and I freeze it, like all my berries and stuff, like I love berries in my smoothie, and as you know, um, produce don't last that long, so if you buy, like buy it in bulk, like when it's on sale, like the two for threes and stuff, you buy it like that, just put it in a Ziploc bag and freeze it, so, um, I grab a handful of that, that's um, what I got in there is blueberries and strawberries. Actually, I'm going to put another handful in there. Um, I got some ground flax seed. It's really healthy. Um, that's all I can say about it right now because I forgot what make, I forgot what it actually does because I've been using it for so many years. I can look it up for y'all if you like. I should be measuring it, but I, I don't hardly measure stuff. It's just flax seed. It can't be that bad. And as I was telling y'all, the spinach. I know it's weird. I'll we'll put like a little pinch of spinach in there, but I swear to God, it will not change the taste of the fruit smoothie. It still tastes like a fruit smoothie. And I got, I don't actually have a brand, but I bought it from Walmart. It's a strawberry um, protein. It's like two scoops, got like 60 grams of protein in it. And it's really good, and it's got it comes in strawberry chocolate and um, it comes in strawberry chocolate and vanilla. Um, I've been drinking the vanilla for years. I hardly ever. Every place don't carry the strawberry, but I wanted to have some strawberry. Okay, and you can put a little bit of water in it and thin it out, or you can put a little bit of ice in it and thicken it up, depending on what you want or what meal it is. For me, this is an actual meal, so I'm gonna put a little bit of ice in it and thicken it up. Hang on for a second. Wrong. These recipes ain't exact, um, and they're gonna all be different. Everybody want a different type of, uh, I guess you would call it density or thickness to their um, today smoothie. What I was trying to show y'all is, I almost dropped my damn phone in the shade. What I was trying to show y'all is, um, that's how you know when it's, everything is completely blended up. When you get that little whirlwind, that little tornado effect, that's how you know when everything is completely blended. Um, then after that, I'm about to transfer it into a cup. It's kind of big, so but it's, it's probably going to make two of them transfer into a cup. And uh, that's my smoothie. That's like my um, breakfast for the day. So... Alright, enjoy y'all day. I'm really late. I was off, so I was kind of lollygagging, but I'm about to head to the gym. I'm about to get these three miles in and hit these weights and drink this water. We're going to do our thing. I'll see y'all Monday.